let's take a deep breath. Because the software I'm about to show you is insane. Face swapping, also known as deep faking, is a method where AI implements a face into an already existing video or image. This piece of software right here does it with outstanding perfection. All with an easy to use user interface and a simple installation process. And the best part, it works on any computer system available. Hey, I'm Toby from Visual by Toby and the software I'm talking about is called Roop. But not the normal version of Roop. I'm talking about Roop Unleashed, which does the same thing, just 10 times better. Let me show you how you can set it up. Even though it works on any operating system, the setup process varies. In this video, I will specifically show you how it's done on a Windows machine. I will put links to documentations about the setup process for other operating systems into the video description. To get it to run on Windows, we need two things. The software, Roop Unleashed itself, and Visual Studio to run it. Let's start with Visual Studio. A link to the download page will be in the video description. Scroll down the page and under Download Visual Studio, select the community version. The download will start automatically. Open the installer file that we just downloaded. While going through the installation process, make sure to select C++ Desktop and C++ Gaming. Otherwise, it's not going to work. Before we continue, consider restarting your computer to complete the Visual Studio setup process. Hey, thanks for tuning in. I hope you're enjoying the video so far because I really put a lot of work and effort into making them. And if you're new here, a sub to the channel would be amazing. Now back to the video. Now that we have Visual Studio installed, let's download Roop Unleashed. The download link from the video description will lead you to a GitHub page. There, click on the green button that says code and select download zip from the dropdown. Navigate to the newly downloaded file and make sure that the folder it's in does not contain any spaces in the name. This is very important because if you do otherwise, you will get an error when trying to install it. Now extract the file so that it's not a zip file anymore. Navigate inside the folder into installer and open the windows run file. Roop Unleashed will automatically download all the different files we need to run it. How long this takes depends on your internet connection. Once it's done, Roop will open by itself. From now on, you can open and run Roop Unleashed by clicking the run windows file, which is the same file that we used for the installation. Every time you open it, you will be questioned if you want to check for updates. Answer with Y for yes or N for no. Press enter to answer. Inside Roop AI, you're greeted with a bunch of different options and features. But first, we need to check if the processing is set to CPU or GPU. Navigate to settings. And under provider, select CUDA if you've got an NVIDIA GPU or CPU if your computer doesn't have a dedicated graphics card at all. If you've got an AMD GPU, I recommend you read the documentation, which is linked in the video description. Now let's do a simple image to video face swap, shall we? Therefore, we need an image of a person with their face and a video of a subject that will later become that person. Let's put the image of our person into that first box and the video into the second box. Then scroll down to select post processing. From my experience, I recommend GPEN and GFP GAN, but preferably GPEN, and an image blend ratio of about 0.8. Then click on start. How long the processing takes depends on the video's resolution and length. And another one for image to image. Therefore, we simply select an image instead of the video for the second box. Processing for image to image usually only takes a few seconds if your computer is good enough.
How do you like the results? I must say, this is the best face swap or deepfake software that I've seen so far. If this video was in any way helpful to you, leave a thumbs up. And also, if you got any questions, write them down below into the comment section. I will try to answer every single one. Stay safe, and I will see you in the next video. Ooh, I like that.